For six years, Gillingham Football Club has helped G Beats Club hold nightclub events for people with disabilities. But spiralling costs due to the pandemic and fuel bills has meant the price for the venue is now too high to continue here. Obviously the rising costs of electricity, everything, um, it's impacted the cost of the venue and the cost of the um, events to run. Um, so unfortunately, at the moment, we are struggling to afford to carry on the events for G Beats at the football club. Football Club. We have decided to reduce the events down to one event per month um, to help with the affordability. Um, we've also set up a GoFundMe page to try and raise as many funds as we can to support the event going forward. Um, and also we are on the search for a new venue. After a difficult two years during COVID when G Beats couldn't run its events at all, they were pleased that when allowed to restart, they were on their way back to having nearly 200 people come every two weeks. Their theme this week was inspired by Grace Allen's wedding, tomorrow. The need for a change of venue has come as a shock. I was devastated when I found out because it's just such a happy environment to be in. For now, not to be able to run it every two weeks is just... Oh, it's just so sad because they've got nowhere else to go. They meet up, they meet their friends here, some meeting couples here. It might be the only time that they get to see each other. I think the club, you know, can really sort of help by sort of um, raising the awareness and obviously supporting Grace to be able to continue these really, really important evenings for the, the disabled community. So far, in less than a week, the G Beats GoFundMe page has raised a quarter of its £2,000 target. Until they're able to raise enough money, they plan to reduce the club nights to once a month while they search for another suitable venue. Sandy Fleming for Raynham News.